Hello and welcome to your first annual Minecraft Survival Games. Your contestants will be Bashar and Elijah. Today they're competing to see who's truly better at Minecraft. Their mission will be to gather resources for the first day and on the second day they will battle to the death to see who's truly the better Minecrafter. And now you will witness the competition. So over here, me on the left, I find what's called the nether portal, and it's a thing that can contain lots of loot, gold blocks, and even has a half-destroyed nether portal, and a nether portal is a device that you use to get into a nether. We'll see Elijah use one of these later. Elijah, would you like to add anything to this clip? What are you doing right here? Uh, I'm just getting some more materials, kind of looking for more stuff, you know. Mm. Anyways, yeah, we're just here. He's gaining some melons. These will be his um, primary food source. He really likes eating melons. And here, I'm just crafting. Let's see. I forgot what I crafted. I'm going to try to make some armor, get some, like, gold stuff. I make sure I'm not all protected so I don't die later in the tournament. Staying alive is very important for this tournament. So, yeah. So, that's what's going on right here. So after here, I find another ruined portal, and we transition to Elijah going in this cave. What is your thought process just being underwater right now? Uh, I was looking for some iron to be able to build some armor, and it turned out that there was nothing really down there. Did you look hard enough? Uh, probably not. Mm. And then it's nighttime. He decides to go outside in the wilderness, no armor, no weapons. And you can see this later kind of backfires on him because, you know, he's taking a lot of damage right here. Got anything to say about this? Uh, you, you almost died at this part, too. Um, uh, let's see, listen, we're talking about your part right now. You got anything to talk about your situation? Oh, you are no. currently I, almost died at half a heart buried in it doesn't matter me fighting bravely. 
like a, a stoic warrior. I still clutched up in the end, so you know. Yeah. You no, know, I clutched up too. You could see me half a heart taking down an entire army by myself. Did not just lose to a singular witch. You know. Yeah, the tournament would definitely wouldn't have been over if, you know, they hit you one more time. I don't think so. I think I still would have won. Anyways, right here, Elijah magically just manages to find this lush cave. Wanna, you want to talk about how you found this cave, buddy? Uh, I found the cave because I'm just built like that. Uh -huh. So you're saying you weren't x-raying to find this? No. It would have showed up on the screen if I was, no? Um, no, because we cut to you being in the cave, so like we didn't show the part where you were exploiting and going in creative mode. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, too bad, because even if you did, it didn't get recorded. Yeah, true. But anyways, I also managed to find the cave, legitly, because you can see me find it. Yep. I'm thinking about my surroundings. I decided to get some dirt, because, like, you always want to have some dirt on you, tactically. There's this, I try to, get, these zombies try to press me. And then I build up, because I don't get pressed. I am the presser. The oppressor. Yeah, we're still recording, by the way. Anyways, look, so what are you doing here? Why are you just, like, why are you swimming on a wall? Um, well, because it turned out that there was a whole ocean on the other side of that wall. I don't, I don't, I don't think that's an ocean, buddy. Or whatever it was. And then you almost die. Yeah, I did almost die right here. And then, like, what are, like, you're just, like, walking back and forth. What have you gained being in this cave? Um, iron. Iron. Yeah. Interesting. And I kind of go AFK for a second. Okay, so here, I actually start going down in the cave. I'm being brave and stuff. There could be monsters here, but I face them all. I'm just him. 
What are you doing right now? Um, from the looks of it, I'm getting more iron and, you know, eating some random fruit that I found. Yeah, the berries. You know those berries? Did you wash those berries? Do you know where they came from? No, I didn't wash them. Anyways, look, I'm just here. I'm just going down this cave like a goat. I jump in the water. I land it. Oh, my God. You could never. I probably could. Wait, are we in the same cave? Uh, I think at this oh. point we are. And you died. Yes, we'll never find out. Wait, so wait. How come the tournament did it in there then? Because it was like, you get unlimited lives before the actual like battle. Oh, okay. So it wouldn't have mattered if you died earlier to the witch. It wouldn't have mattered, except for the fact that I've lost items, which is very bad. You don't want to lose items in this tournament, because it puts you very hard. I just came back. I came, I come back at the end. So. You come back at the end? Yeah. Ooh, is he, might, is he spoiling? He might have actually won the tournament? Ooh. Who will win, though? It's kind of it's kind of a close match right now, but he is very step back. And he's just in the jungle, swinging from vine to vine. Uh, not too unexpected. That's why I told me he had a lot of experience with that. Well, why would you, why would you say that? Here in the cave, we turned up the brightness so it's easier to see everything. You know, it might not have been um, enjoyable to some people's eyes if we just left it the way it was. So we just made it a lot brighter so that way everyone could see what's going on and so you could be more clearly to see what's going on in the tournament. You see, I'm here. I'm on the hunt for iron. I'm trying to get some diamonds. Elijah's, like, coal mining for some reason. Why, why are you just mining for coal? Um, You know, I actually skipped past some diamonds right there, I think. I'm not gonna lie, I think I skipped past some diamonds on that part. Oh, diamonds. You skipped past diamonds? Mm, I think so. Well, speaking of diamonds, is this the part where I find some? No, oh, I don't think so. Oh, I'm, st I'm still gonna try. I'm gonna get them eventually. Oh, wait, look at that. What's in here? <gasps> A diamond! Got anything to say for yourself? Uh, ratio. Ratio? Oh, nah. You see, I couldn't let that slide. I almost see. Look at that. There's a trap right there. I wonder who set that. It was me. It's always Elijah. Be careful. Check your surroundings. You might have a wild Elijah roaming around your neighborhood. But, um. Yeah, or a wild Bashar. Those don't exist. Anyways. So, I'm in here the mine shaft. You know, there's like. This mine shaft a bit perplexing, so I kind of get tangled and tangled up all in it. But I think I find something right here. What is this? More minecart. Um. Anything you're doing that's interesting right now? You um, just wait. Did you just skip past some diamonds right there? I might have also right there too. Let's. Oh, that's a shame. I saw something blue for a second. I think it might have been diamonds. I guess we could look back. This happened to me like three times. I think. That is an L. 
Right, so here we have this munch getting more melons. I find a cave. Let's look at a goaded cave. What are you doing right now? Why are you just collecting so many melons? Uh, food resource. How does this help you in the fight? Uh, so I don't lose health or not health, but you know, hunger. You know, these only restore one bar per melon. Actually, I think they restore half a bar. That's why I have so much. And they have low saturation too. I don't know what saturation is. It's like means when you eat something, like how long you stay full for. And like you don't over fuller. Yeah. So anyways. Ooh, that was cool. So I find a cave right here. Cave Loki goaded. Ooh, I find something. I know. I already know. It's tingling. I feel a tingle. Something's good. It's always good when I feel a tingle. What kind of tingle? <laughs> you know, you seen how I'm Dragon Ball Super? Uh -uh. You know Khalifa gets the tingle in the back? Yeah. Before yeah. she goes Super Saiyan? Kind of an elf way to go Super Saiyan. True, but like, kind of feel like, kind of felt like that tingle. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Yeah, so like, so like, yeah. Anyways, we're here. Oh, this is the best clip. Find some diamonds. Don't mine at night. That's not gonna get us copyright stroke, is it? Uh, oh no. Yeah. Actually, it's like a parody of a song. So it's like if she's saying it's like a parody of a parody. I don't think like the people that have the lawyers. I don't even think they own the rights to use the song. Yeah, so like, I mean, if anything, we blame blame them, sue them, not us. Anyways, I find diamonds. You just copying my strat in my cave, copying me. Are we even in the same cave? They look similar. That doesn't mean we're in the same one though. Let's look at our coordinates. Wait, why am I in my inventory? I'm just the goat, okay? So you're about uh So what you're saying is basically if, you're about six hundred blocks away. But what you're saying is basically if you know we saw each other, the tournament would have ended right there. No, we literally see each other at the beginning of the match. No, like like, but if we saw each other, we would have probably fought. I mean, if we saw each other, I probably would have just smoked you, and then like you'd have to restart again. But I wouldn't do that since I'm so nice. Isn't your armor gold? You have. Where is your armor? That's you are. What do you have? We're not going to talk about that. What do you have right now? We are not going to talk about that. Plus, I have the resources to make me some armor. I have diamonds. I have riz. What do you have right now? Infinite riz. That's not riz. That is...
Anyways. So weird. Anyways, we're trying to do this. I think this is the part where I find some diamonds. Elijah is just smelting random items for no apparent reason. I do not know his thought process. Uh, my thought process is, you know, if you could eat it, if it looks um, edible, you can eat it. I see diamonds right there. I think that's what I'm pointing out to you, roasting you for having no diamonds, for having no, like, barely any gold, for just having, like... No maidens, you know? No maidens? No maidens for you. I have infinite maidens. I have infinite Riz. Stole all your maidens. I almost drown here, but I don't drown because I'm the goat and goats don't drown. Now this absolute patty whack tries to lock me out of the nether by destroying his portal. Little does he know, I'm chill like that. Which, it doesn't even make any sense how he got in there still. Well, I mean, he just made a new portal. That's stupid. I mean, how? Because it just, just cancelled out the whole portal itself. So the portal would just not work. Exactly. Um, I don't, I don't think... Oh, Riz. Anyway, so I'm on the hunt. And then Elijah is sweating. You can see him right there, top left. He's sweating. He doesn't know what to do. He knows He knows the hunt is on. I was uh, looking for a netherite. Yeah, but will, will, will we find any? Uh, so, that's, that's for us to find out by watching the video, you know? Look at him panic. Look at him mining. I've never seen so mine. Look at me. I'm just taking my time. I'm just getting some gold. Hey, yeah. Look, Piglin, trying to steal my gold. You just let it slide. Almost ran up on folk. You know what? Because, like, I have things to focus on. Like? Like, hunting you down. And then here, you know, I'm getting prepared to be able to fight Bashad because I know he's here, too. <clears throat> yeah, he knows I'm there, but, like, will he be able to do anything about it? You think you can do something about it? You think you can stop me? I think I can. No one stops me. Anyways, 
we will let you just enjoy this chase for a little bit longer. We'll be back soon. We see right here the hunt is on. I don't think Elijah knows I'm here yet, but I see him. I see his name tag down there. I'm just ready. Uh, I knew he was there the whole time, and that's when I started to run right here, and then I got caught in a little slope around this yeah. area. I was thinking to head, head down there at first. Then I realized I have Feather Falling 4 on the boots I got earlier from the, from the Ruined Portal, so I could just jump down there. Uh, you see Santiago in the background. He's trying to do the latest Fortnite dance. Got a bit tired. He need to take a break right there, but like, anyways. And around right here is, you know, the part I struggle at because I was trying to get in there to, you know, do the thing and then the other thing. Yeah, and he's just low-key running from me right now. Like, he said he was prepared. And look, I, get, I, like, I, like, I like the... I like either. I sneak around. He don't even know I exist right now. He's in his inventory. He thinks it's sweet. He's like, oh, nothing's wrong. He's like, what? What do you think right here? Uh, you, you said know, no chance. You came out of nowhere. That's what I think. You said no chance. Uh, I was shot into lava. And then, burned to a crispity crisp. I win. But, I felt so bad about how much better I am at this game. I gave him another chance. We'll cut to that right here. Mm. Knowing how little damage I'm doing right now. Anyways, this will be the last voiceover you'll hear from us because pretty soon we get our audio back so you actually get to hear us in the match. Anything you want to say to our viewers? Uh, it, did, it was a W game. It really. It was a nice entertaining you. Five, 
four, two, one. It's just time sucks. You're a bug. Yeah, I win! Bruh, I can the final. Thank you for coming and watching our Minecraft stream. Yeah, this is very fun. Thank you for everything. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the times we had, the moments we didn't.